Tonight's good news for 13 is a pretty unbelievable story. A cat reunited with its owners after it ran away and was lost for 56 days. It definitely had nine lives, right? 13 News reporter Natalie Wattis has details on how this miraculous reunion was even possible. 56 days ago, a rest stop off of exit 10 of the Interstate 64 was the last place Zach and Holly Tobin saw their beloved cat Luna. They had been moving back to the U.S. after living abroad in London and were making the trip from St. Louis to Washington, D.C. And it's almost exactly halfway, Huntington from St. Louis to D.C., uh, and he, he got out at the rest stop. Luna was gone. First thing we did when he got out after utter panic ensued <laughs> was trying to reach out to the local vets. And the receptionist actually told us about a couple Facebook groups. And so she posted a couple things on Facebook. Then, finally, a sighting. Well, that was last night, and I think I'm still in shock. <laughs> Teresa Atkins was a part of one of those Facebook groups. She knew she had a duty to find Luna since his owners could not stay. I understand they had to get back. They couldn't stay here. But we were local and we had said we were try our best and we would do everything we we could. I mean, there was a few times that we were kind of, we lost a little bit of hope because there wasn't any sightings. And then we got a call Sunday that he was sighted. So Atkins' group set traps, and when she went back to check them Tuesday, there he was. He was just laying on the hillside like nobody's business. Here, you can see the exact moment Luna was found. And finally, the reunion. Wednesday afternoon, as the Tobins returned to West Virginia to pick Luna up. If you ever lose faith in humanity, lose an animal and have people show you how good they are. In Huntington, I'm Natalie Wattis, 13 News, working for you. That is amazing. Happy reunion, definitely. The Tobins say without the local community pitching in, they would have never expected to see Luna again. Well, congratulations to them for getting their little furry family member back. And if you have positive story ideas like this one during these challenging times, we'd love to hear from you. You can share them with us by sending an email to news at wowktv.com.